Hello, you beautiful people. Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Be Perfect mystery bag. And this retailed for £25. It literally went live on Thursday at midnight slash Friday morning for Black Friday. And I sat and queued on the website to get this. Like I said, it's £25. There wasn't really much details on what it was going to include. It just had like little hints like it might include a brand new eyeshadow palette. But there wasn't really kind of set what you would get in it or any kind of a clear guidance. So let's just see what I got in my little bag. If you are new here, by the way, I am Lucy Seamson, but you can call me Luce because we're all friends here. If you are new, don't forget to hit subscribe and give this video a thumbs up because it really helps out my channel. And don't forget to turn that notification bell on as well so you're notified every single time that I upload because I'm uploading five plus times a week now, which is actually just crazy. And if you haven't joined my Patreon and you are interested, I will leave all the links down below as well for you to have a little look at that. I just want to say thank you so much for my patrons for actually picking tonight's video because I'm literally filming this the same day that I'm uploading it. So thank you so much because I was going to do a totally different video and then this came in the post. So obviously I'm going to do this for you. In case you're wondering what lip combination I've got on, I don't know if I like it. To be honest. <laughs> but I just thought I'll just wear it anyway. So this is the Doll Beauty Lip Liner in Girl Code. And I've tried this for the first time. This is the I Heart Revolution, like they're like chocolate lipsticks, and this one's in the shade Cookie Dough, which is very, very, very nude and very pinky purpley. So it's whether you're into that kind of thing. And then just for a gloss, just to, I don't know, juice it up a little bit, I put on some of my Kylie gloss in Damn Gina, which is just like a really, really old mini one. But, anyways, let's get into what was in my Be Perfect £25 mystery bag. So, I'm not gonna lie. Bit disappointed with this bag, I just want to get that out in, in the get-go. Bit disappointed because there's only one makeup product in it and obviously I'm the makeup kind of person and the rest of it's more tan, which obviously I very clearly don't do. So yeah, I am a little bit disappointed but I will just kind of grab whatever and we'll just see what we've got. So the first thing that we have is the Be Perfect Velvet Tanning Mitt and this is just a dual sided mitt. I do actually really like these tanning mitts. These are my favourite ones when it comes to applying tan when I do put it on which is very, very rare. This would be something that I would generally pick up and I was having a little look on the website to try and work out what is the value of the actual bag itself and when I looked at the mitt, that mitt is worth £5.99 anyway, so it would be something that I would personally use, just not often, if that makes sense. I'd rather have got like a makeup goodie. The next one that we have is the Makeup and Tanning Headband. So it just looks like this. This actually retails for £9.95, so quite pricey to be fair for a headband. I'm going to open it up and see what it looks like, but it's all no, I absolutely love Oh, it's got a little be perfect on it. <laughs> I absolutely love headbands, anything to kind of get my hair out of my face when it comes to putting my makeup on as well. And I think this would be good for skincare to kind of wrap it round. It kind of reminds me of what I wear when I go, oh my God, I've got my hair all over my face now. It reminds me of what I wear when I go and get a facial. It's the same kind of setup as that and it has just like the little Velcro for you to tie it round. But I, I personally wouldn't pay 9 99 for that, but that's just my opinion. The next one is a pop socket. I don't know if this is included, like whether everybody just got this in the mystery bag or whether this is like included in one of the products. I'm not too sure, but I don't mind it. I couldn't find it on the website, so I don't know how much the value of it is, but I love pop sockets. This is my Nikki Tutorials and Beauty Bay one, so I will definitely get my use out of it. So I'm, I'm happy that I've got that. And then the last kind of tanning related product is this one. This is the Golden Hour Glow Illuminating Instant Tan, wash off 24 hour, and it's meant to smell like a tropical scent. This is the Sundown Medium Tan. I was gonna open it, but it's got a little seal on it. So I'll leave it because I'd rather keep it fresh. But if there was gonna be like a tan that I would kind of pick up, it would be something like this because I do really like them for nights out. Not that we're gonna be going anywhere anytime soon, but sometimes it's nice just to put a quick layer of tan on and then the next day after you've been on your night out, just getting in the shower and just watching it all go off your body. It's like the dirt of the night out is just gone. <laughs> but this retails for £14.99. So obviously that's still good retail value considering obviously it's a tan. It's worth quite a lot of money. And then my most favourite thing out of the whole bag and probably the most exciting thing for us, um, unless you're a tanning kind of gal, is this eyeshadow palette. 
So this is the Be Perfect Manifest eyeshadow palette. I've looked on the website, this must be the new one that they're talking about that could have been in the, in the actual bag. I can't find like a value price for it, but it says, manifest your perfect look. It contains 12 ultra, 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 ultra versatile shades in a variety of different textures to let your artistry run wild. Seven velvet matte, two glitters, one look shimmer and two marble shades. I must admit, this eyeshadow palette has just made the full bag. And I'm actually really, really glad. I think this the, the mystery bag itself was worth it just for this eyeshadow palette because the only other way that you can buy this currently is the gift set that's on their website and also on Boots. And that gift set is, I think it was like 40 pound or something. And you get, obviously you get a couple of other things in the gift set, but the main thing that I would have wanted out of the gift set would have been this. So I'm really, really, really happy that this is in here. I do think that if there was like a lipstick instead of this, I would have been absolutely good. That'd be £25. So I do think the eyeshadow palette has made up for it. Let's see what it looks like. Oh my God, the pans are huge. Oh, that pride colour is gorgeous. Another reason that I wanted this palette really, really bad is because I saw Claire, I'll leave her YouTube link down below because she did a full unboxing of the Be Perfect gift set that I've just been talking about, that's in Boots and on their website and you get some other goodies in it as well. She did a full unboxing and testing this palette out. And as soon as I saw the look that she did with this palette, I was like, okay, I need that. <laughs> so I'm so, like, look how huge it is. So, so, so glad that I've got this in my collection. Now, that pride shade, oh my God, in secret is a glitter as well. So this is what it looks like. Oh my God, that is actually stunning. Please let me know if you want me to do a tutorial on this because I will definitely do that for you. I think that buzzing shade is going to be beautiful as a highlighter as well. Oh, I want to swatch it so bad, but I'm going to resist. <laughs> I couldn't really work out how much the value of this palette would be anyway, but I do think, obviously, the palette and the rest of the goodies definitely made up for the £25 price tag of the mystery bag. I just would have wished that there was a bit more makeup instead of, like, accessories and tan stuff in it in comparison to, obviously, getting all that and then the eyeshadow palette. I know for instance, Alex got a lipstick and an eyeshadow palette in hers. So yeah, it would have been nice just to have another eyeshadow, um, like another makeup product in here. Cause man, it was literally all tan apart from this eyeshadow palette. But I do think, oh, I do think that's made up for it. Don't you? I wonder what that is. I'm gonna have to swatch it. I'm sorry. <gasps> oh, it's like, oh, ho, 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 ho. Well, the thing is, but you're gonna have to, gonna have to use a glitter glue because it doesn't go down. Oh my god! Oh, this is actually beautiful. I can't believe that I was. Look at that pink. Oh my god, that's a marble. That one. Okay. Yeah, I think we're definitely. Wow. Can you see? <laughs> that one's called I love. <laughs> I don't think it's meant to be said like that, but that's how I'm gonna say it. Um, okay, yeah, please let me know if you want me to do a tutorial on this and whether you want it to be next week because I will prioritise this over some of my other videos. Wow. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much to my patrons for suggesting for me to do this video for tonight. I guess I will leave the link down below if you want to join my Patreon. It's entirely up to you. There's no pressure. I will love you if you join and I will also love you if you just continue to support me through my YouTube. I love you either way. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow for a brand new video. Bye guys. Oh my god, look at my fingers. Oh. <laughs>